And whenever you're ready, let me know. I'll jump in the Chubby Raven and we'll take off. Alright, so we got that in there. Let's go ahead and put in our arrows. Bam. I should need one too. This is a scout. Okay. I've got two of our gravel sisters sifting gravel. Granted, they they can't do anything else because they can't offload it because the others right. aren't finished. But, uh, yeah, I've got resources going. And... What do you need for resources to finish the others? Uh, it looked like power cells. The power cells may have been yoinked to that I requested or it may have been yoinked for your stuff, Daniel. I don't know. But yeah, it it needs twelve more power cells. And then the loot should be good to where all the resources that they get by sifting the gravel um, yeah, goes back that. into the refinery. I think we'll stick with small thrusters even though I know better. Alright, I'm heading to the Revan. Alright, we'll place a couple more thrusters and I'll meet you there shortly. You may have to make your own uh, seat. I don't remember if I have multiple seats in there or not. I don't think I do. Okay. I'm, I'm seated. Okay. This is I figure out how to get out of here because lag is throwing me all around. There we go. <laughs> and I am fully prepared to lose the Chubby Raven at this point, but I don't think I will. <laughs> God, if you lose the Chubby Raven, I'm going to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's going to be all on pilot error because the Chubby yes. Raven could be able, should be able to swat this thing out of the sky. It, you're going to be upside down. I know. Alright. Thrusters on. And I forgot to set that. So that's going to be fun for a moment. Alright. We're Oh, right there in front of me. Yeah, the purple. Dangerous encounter. Alright. All guns are turned on. Moving in. I need to turn on my shield. Okay, the the nose of this thing mm -hmm. it, that spawns in. If it's a shielded one, stay out. Well, either way, do not sit in front of it. Okay. Gotcha. You you want to be moving, and you want to be able to not let it keep its nose on you for a length of time because it that's what will insta drop your shields damn full. I do like the groupings of asteroids yeah I, I really really like that it feels more natural you want to peek at my um, my shield health real quick alright uh where is your shield health? Or is it only visible inside the control? It's gonna... Oh! What the hell? I just killed myself. That's what that was. Okay. Do you have a spawn point on the Chubby Raven? Yes. Yeah. Closing blast shields. I do like that. There's the the uh, shield control table. Six million health. 
Not sure where he's at. Uh, ah, shielded. It is a shielded drone. A shielded vengeance drone. Okay, this is the boss. Basically, one of the bossing. Well, we know what these guns can do to shields, so. Yeah, except it's a scripted shield. Uh, fun. Hey, Daniel. Yeah. Uh, you might uh, want to uh, be prepared to flee if need be. Hopefully you're... Fuzz, do you have your weapons on? Yes, my weapons are on and it's already firing at it, I think. Because yeah. it's kill it, killing my power. About how far away are you? Um... About 70. 8 kilometers. Okay. So... Yeah, try and keep on its back. As long as that, those... Ah, it's pointing at ya. It's pointing at ya. Want me to turn the weapons on the station back on? You can. I'm just thinking that you might want to be prepared to f flee. To do a GTFO? Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Since we yeah, can't cool. see the weapons firing on Fuzz's ship, we just assume they are. They are targeting. I can see them targeting. You see the damage being done? Well, I'll tell I'm, you what. I'm seeing an explosions on his on the vengeance. So. You can take control of one of the big Aegis guns if you want to, at any point. Yeah, I'm. Okay, I'm sitting in the I'm sitting in the cockpit. Right, there. I'm actually gonna fly over and kind of spectator this. See what sort of. Yeah, I've seen explosions on it. Uh, where is it? it looks to me like it may be uh, heading. It's it, it's it's making a run towards something. Aegis, is it the medium multi laser? Yeah. Got to figure out which way is front on this thing. Up, oh, it's doubling back. Okay, let's see if I can. Okay, I took its shields down. <laughs> My shields are down. Curse you! Oh, look, there's another dangerous encounter over there. Go figure. Okay. Does that mean this one's dead in the water? I may have just cored it with your lasers. Yeah, I mean, I mean, manually targeted. These things are nuts, powerful. Because I mean, on their own, they're just gonna target what they normally target. Oh shit! You're out of fuel. You not have enough fuel to stop? I got none. I can't even turn my ship. And the infinity is swinging by underneath. I'm going to ram the next. Ouchie. It still has a few guns online. Yeah. <clears throat> um, I still see reactor power back here. They're still green. So right, start shutting things down. There like, we go. That's what it was. I think you're overloading. I was, yeah. Even those are currently killing things. Alright, so my shield's are building back up. It's currently dead in the water. So that's a thing. Alright, I'm gonna... Well, not completely dead in the water. It's still got uh, active um, turrets. 
but I'm gonna let my shields back up, build back up before I move back over there. Uh, must be down to purely uranium. Yeah. I. Yeah, uh, I'm purely down to ura uranium fuel. No, you don't. Man, those oh, shit. those no, things. No, 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 no. Those things really eat through power. Holy crap. Well, it's not moving, which is a plus. I, I had one health left. I was going to die. But All right, I, well, yeah. I, right I wanted to... The fuzz has got to pay. Yeah, I want to make sure this thing that can't nuke us while you're gone. Why did I suddenly stop? Because there was a giant lag spike at the at that particular moment. Yes, but I mean, I lost all momentum, all forward momentum at that point. Oh no, it does the same thing to me. Like the moment a lag spike happens, I happen to be falling and then all of a sudden I'm standing still on top of the structure again. But yeah, uh, it it I was flying out to the and if it hadn't just pulled me to a dead stop you would have slammed into it no I wouldn't have been shot and killed <laughs> I was almost to cover what the... see this this really does piss me off. What it's like? Oh, the lag. Yeah. The fact that it decides nope, you're here with no momentum in any direction because screw you. I am. I don't have any tools on me, do I? No, I do not. All right. Remote control block, dead. I have one life left, or one health left. Well, I currently got all my health left, and I just got here. I don't know how you got here, and... Okay. Beam weapon is disabled. Nice. What was it using for a quote-unquote beam weapon? Camera. Uh, camera. Ah. Okay. Is that out of power? Nope. I just got shot. By what? A Gatling turret on the front of the thing. Oh. Ah. Oh, shit! I somehow survived with zero health again. You know, I'm just happy that it's and I'm dead. It's Uber Beam is dead. Right. Now, I was more concerned about that than anything else. Okay. Well, do you want to try to take it home, or do you just want to let here and let cleanup get it? A cleanup can get it. All right, let's head home. Uh, We're not that far away from home. That was the part that scared me, was when I looked and saw exactly where it was pointed. It wasn't pointed at the, the Korax. It was pointed at um, the, the Icarus. What'd you call my ship? Korax? Corvus? No, I didn't say Corvus. I just said it, called it Korax. What you say, man? Okay, needs more fuel, but it can definitely hold its own relatively well. Yeah. Also needs to know where to target the things huh? for their weakness. 
Well, I mean, for that, I'm going to need a, a, a gunner. gunner. Yeah. yeah. Just because of targeting fun. I don't know if this... Daniel's monstrosity is almost done. Yep. You know, I do find it interesting that... Daniel has home-built his ship twice. Your ship is completely home-built. I'd say a good, what, 50% <laughs> of the uh, the Knicks is captured or stolen uh, and just integrated ships. I haven't built any large ships. That's probably a good thing. Probably. I, when we really think about it, that's probably a good thing. Mm-hmm. Um, Assault Corvette, you're in for a really bad day. Oh, yeah. Uh, we can turn the guns on. <laughs> All the guns. Yeah, just 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 light it up. Let it be. Let it learn its lesson. The hard way. I've already got air pressure through most of the core of the ship. Okay, uh... I take it Daniel's nowhere near close to... A Turn control panel? On. At the moment? No. <laughs> All guns on. Vulcans on. Alright, I need to get uranium in this thing and ice, which I think we have like none of. It's coming in from the front. Probably our weakest <laughs> direction because we're not manually controlling the Big Bertha. Right. I mean, you can always just turn it. Oh, well. It, it's going to hit the shields and everything's going to go bad for it. It's going to yeah. have a really bad day. It's going to have a bad time, yo. Uh, did it just get it? Not yet. Nope, it thumped. <laughs> it thumped a little bit. Speaking of, now that we have that over-amped power room, can't you turn the solar... Oh! Oh no! Shit! Yeah. Shit! I wasn't really docked yet! <laughs> God damn. Jump, Fuzz. That's the only way to get you out of this. Because you are currently inside bits of the... Yeah. <sighs> um, I know I've got jump drives. I'll put them in. Okay, you're outside of it. You're outside of... Looks like the ship lost power. Oh, the one we were shooting at? Yeah. Yeah. We lost a lit a bit of one of the um, Cerberuses. Oh? Yeah, it clipped it pretty hard as it got thumped. Ah, that's not too bad. We can fix that. Oh, yeah. Also, I... Don't think I have dirt drives on this. I thought I did. I don't. No, I do have a jump drive. Why didn't it show up? Is it a spice drive? I don't think so. Maybe. It is a spice drive. Okay. Well, that's the reason that didn't show up. All right. Good to know. Okay, I'm gonna try docking again. <laughs> I'm sitting here trying to line up 
and all of a sudden the next just says, "Oh hi, bam." <laughs> Damn, you did tear up a bunch of shit. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, I'm sitting here, and I, I mean, my mass is like two million two hundred thousand, almost three hundred thousand kilograms of just no. I'm not going to move. And then the Nick says, "I'm going to move." Shit happens. Know what I mean, man? Yeah, is your insurance going to pay for it? Yeah, my insurance is good. Okay. Don't worry about it. I've got even insurance, man. It'll pay for your ship, but mm, not much for your installments. I mean, all, all your weapons and stuff, you kind of fucked on that. You know what I mean, man? I got that Eve insurance. So oh, Eve shit. did you took, drop... You, you hmm? took out one of our large thrusters. Yeah, I hit hard. <laughs> I, I, I think I have said that well enough. I hit hard. I was roughly here when we got thumped hard, which the Nick said, Hi, I'm coming in. And there was nothing I could do. I couldn't even maneuver quick enough to get out. Hey we are back. How's it? Whoop, whoop. Facing the right way. There we go. Hey, folks, we're back. Yay. How y'all doing? We're done flailing about and doing our shenanigans for today. Hope y'all enjoyed the fun. What did we do? What's attacking? I don't know. I think we're about to get thumped again. Yeah, there's a corrupt salvage drone. Do corrupt salvage drone. <sighs> so, yeah. Uh, mods are working properly now. As y'all could probably have told, yeah, we got thumped. Oh, I, yeah, I, I, we we're I, getting thumped I've, all around. I've left you and us. I'm looking at the action. That <laughs> debris is incoming. Damn, we're we got thumped. Get, we're about to get thumped again. I think by debris. No, we moved no, out, I don't out do of the that. way of debris. Uh, where's oh, where, it? where where where? Yeah, there we go. Forward there. There it goes. <laughs> I wouldn't step forward at all, Fuzz. <laughs> oh, did we lose a Fuzz? No. So anyway, uh, I got. I have to keep. I I'm in spectator, and I keep after zooming back. So anyway, much has happened today. Uh, I gave the Corvus, the well, the the carcass, carcass, the caucus Corvus, uh, quite a bit of a run for its money. I took off after a uh, what was it? It was a uh, dangerous. No, before that, the smaller one. Uh, anyway, it was a uh, it was something. I don't remember what it was. Uh, it held up on its own well enough, and then we took off. Hey. hey. Hey, hey, hey. I didn't kill you. I haven't yet killed you. <laughs> and then I went after the uh, the exiled engineer and found out that the the chubby raven there is very very power hungry. Very, yes, it's very power hungry. It needs a lot of power, but when given the power it needs, it's a force to be reckoned with. As long as you can target it. Yeah. Because uh, space engineers targeting and what it does, its power is not properly utilized. So with a gunner, a proper gunner on hand to target and basically cut a ship in half, it's a force to be reckoned with. Daniel has finished a lot of his ship through not building. Yep. But he's also building something way, way big. His axolotl two, which I really don't see it, not anymore. It's it's a tube. Well, the nose hasn't been built yet. Yeah, I can I can see the nose though. It's a tube. Honestly, it favors a uh, 
an orca to me from Eve. Yeah. At least at least the general shape on top here. Uh huh. But that's not all we did because look up here. Look up here. We have an Inquisitor. D Swank captured an Inquisitor, which is going to be his next fighter ship. Yep. Yeah. Right. Yes. He's I am in the process it. of refitting it. It's going to with as big as the Corvus is. Mm-hmm. And uh, Daniel's monstrosity over there. The little battle barge. I mean, she's good for what she is, and I may leave her as a a capture ship. I think she'd yeah. be excellent as a capture ship. Absolutely. Um, because she's small, she's got the docking feet. Um, she's got shielding. Um, plenty of thrusters. Basically, everything you need for a capture ship in her, and. That's good. Uh, but I I felt like I if we were going to be having actual combat ships for the three of us, um, I felt like I needed something bigger, heftier. And <clears throat> instead of going around and building something like Daniel, I figured I'd save a lot of resources by taking this, which I really like the, the way it's set up. Uh-huh. I like and it a lot. refitting it with the mods that we have and turning it into mine. Giving it yeah, a so, name at some point. And yeah, so whoever actually designed this, kudos. Oh yeah, props it's a cool to you. ship. Props but anyway, while, while D-Swank was capturing this, I captured this down here, which wasn't much of a capture considering it had nothing offensive on it at all. It yeah, basically, just well, kind of waltzed in and said, "Mine." You know why it had nothing offensive on it at all? <laughs> because that up there was guarding it, right? But we are going to convert this into a mobile refinery to accompany D Swank's uh, uh, muffin, muffin monster, monster, which recently got its nose upgrade, as yeah, y'all can see. Nose job. Yeah, it did. And so the Muffin Monster is actually, I think, at its last iteration. I think I, so, because it's uh, thrusters. All of its thrusters have been upgraded. Yeah, the only thing I can think of that might be worth upgrading, and then I'd have to practically take the back end off, but putting in uh, azimuth uh, reactors. Yeah, you could do that. But yeah, the mu I the Muffin Monster is a solid little mining ship. It's simple, mm -hmm. and it does its job very well. Absolutely. So. so all in all, we got quite a bit done today without doing a damn thing, hardly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, 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 oh! And then this happened. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so, <laughs> so well, as well, as I was I, trying, I, huh? I kind of want to add in that my uh, Inquisitor up there, uh, uh, whatever I'm gonna rename it, um, it fought considering off an IDMC frigate yes, and it did. a harpoon uh, Corvette without um, with vanilla weapons. Yeah, vanilla weapons while I was capturing it. Yeah. Uh, do you plan on keeping the color scheme? Uh, I'm thinking I might take part of the color scheme. Because here's uh, the dangerous part. Here's the dangerous part. The color scheme it currently has is already favoring something aquatic. Yeah, I know. I know. I might... I actually really like the color scheme. I love the muted colors. Yeah. Again, kudos. <laughs> to the yeah. Designer. I I I might keep it, just because. Yeah. Um, I'm probably going to 
go all in and refit the uh, uh, refit it, clean it, uh, clean the interior up, so it's it's more of well, a one man combat ship. Right. Uh, here is a suggestion, though. With oh. with all of us, me, well, I'm more or less done. I just need fuel on mine and a little bit of interior work. But with you and Daniel building and refitting and everything else and us doing what we're doing and honestly needing to pad it out a little bit, we may want to think about some more refineries on the station just so we can actually push out the other resources that we're clogging up on. I really think how much... When was the last time we actually went mining? Well, we're not mining, but we are clogged on sheer resources. Yes. And they, they can't move. Yeah, they can. They can. Now, I can't move, but... <sighs> or... Well... Anyway, on that yawn, on that yawn, I do want to take a quick note of the fun that we had at the very end as we were trying to set up for a goodbye. I was trying to park. I was trying to dock. And we got attacked by a... Was it a kamikaze? No. No, it was a Corvette. It was a Corvette. Uh, Corvette. It was a, a Rebirth it was a, Corvette. It was a nasty ship, and I was all the way over here, trying to dock. Like a little baby. Yes, and basically I, I was just right here, just about ready to hit P. And thump. And that little thump sent me flying square into the side of our nacelle over here. And tore it all the hell up. It doesn't look as bad now because the building repairs kind of repaired what was there. But as you can see, teeth are knocked out, bits are knocked out. It got hit hard. Thankfully, my ship didn't because shields. But yeah, we got thumped hard. But uh, anyway, that is that. Prioritize docking. Yes. So anyway, what the hell? Did you really put a river cockpit on this thing? Where? Oh, on the nose? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> what? Wow! I put it there because you, sometimes you Sioux guys have trouble coming in those airlocks when you're running low on oxygen, so I literally piped it up to the main system, and oh, well. now we have a forward... Uh... I don't I don't trust those things anymore. <laughs> well, there's no planet for you to run into. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, before, <laughs> before we log out, yeah, I would like to paste in the wonder. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. We're going to see if the the server can handle it. Okay, shift. No, hold left in. I forgot to. Turn a feature off. But that's no big deal. And while D-Swank is doing that, I know I kind of mentioned it during the uh, during the recording session here, but I will be upgrading the computer's uh, the server's uh, processor in the next week of this recording. Uh, somebody want to blueprint just in case this thing starts firing away? Yeah, uh, moment. I don't remember what guns are on it. But, uh... We will be moving from an I-3 connection problem. I Game just paused. pasted it. <laughs> okay. Nix is blueprinted. Uh, anyway. We'll be moving from an I... Yep, it's firing off. Uh, it's the Nix shooting at it, though. Yeah. Want to turn the guns off? Oh, lag is stopping me. Daniel, are you close enough? I'll delete the wanderer and then we can yeah. turn them off. Got it.
So yeah, we'll be moving from an I3 to an I7. Fewer Tell me when cores, you get the guns off. I'll do it. Fewer cores, because, you know, I don't need multitasking on the server machine, but higher gigahertz and a much better processor. Uh, let's see. Did you group all the guns into one, Daniel? No. So I heard you. No. I uh, grouped all of the uh, Vulcans into one group. And everything else. Gats are off. I think, unless things are added, all guns does contain all guns. So I, The Vulcans weren't added to it. Uh, go into it. So type in Vulcans. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. Tell me when. Vulcans, there they are. Off. Alright. Pacing. Might still be a gun or two here or there on yeah. because of shenanigans. Alright, not seeing any fire. Oh, wow. Also upside down. No. The Wanderer's not upside down. She's right oh. side up to the... Yeah, it is. Okay. Yep, definitely a far more dense ship. I'd say she's about as big. I mean, she's yeah. dense, but she's probably the same size. But she was also built as a ship, and right. not as a... Station. Right. You know, this looks so much bigger during the uh, episodes. But that's perspective. Yeah. I mean, she... Like I said... It's not a small ship. Not small. Inbound. I did. I didn't think she was as... I didn't realize just how big she was, but she's not... No, I... I still can't believe just how big our Project 4 ships was getting. Yeah. I, we really... I need to return to my ship and finish it. I think that my Project 4 ship would fit in my current fleet builds. Yes. I just need to finish it. But in the current sizes, what would that actually fit in? What would that be? Well, what we're doing it for, I'd probably put it Battleship or Flagship. Okay. For the build off or the the fleet builds, but not okay. necessarily a. Uh... Yeah, whatever. That. Right. But ah, oh God, just flying around this thing. Do you remember? Did you see the video where I landed this on the? On the moon? Yeah. And it bounced? Yes. <laughs> yes, I did. It was so dumb. <laughs> no. And here's the hangar uh, that I was working on. I'm kind of surprised that a couple of these ships we haven't come across. I mean, I know we're not going to come across the, uh, uh, Hostile Universe cruisers. Right. But the other three, we haven't seen yet, and I'm kind of surprised about that. So anyway, to any and everyone that's actually stuck around through all of this long ass farewell, yep, we do appreciate farewell. it. <laughs> we do really appreciate it. We hope you come back again for the following recordings and streams as we do them. As we do appreciate your support and general 
appearance and love and all that good stuff. And yes, I've had a little bit of drink because that's what the fuzz does. So, until next time. Bye bye. Good night, everybody.